was hoping to find you alive. Quite a narrow escape. Darth Tormund was not as fortunate, I trust. Doubting I held up my end of the bargain? Not at all. I only wanted confirmation that he won't trouble anyone again. Perhaps it's best that I'm getting out of politics. Ranging assassinations couldn't be farther from what I've stood for. After falling this far, I suppose there's no point in trying to recover my principles. Coming clean would only do more harm than good. You don't cast off honor when it's inconvenient. I never said I was excusing my failures. I'm only living with them. It was for a greater good. We may be far from achieving peaceful coexistence, but the fewer men like Tormund that come to power, the better our chances. As far as anyone knows, Tormund died in a foolish naval battle. Let's leave it that way. You're a good man, Chancellor. The Republic will be worse off without you. I'm glad you weren't the monster June made you out to be. You'll be exonerated as I promised. Even if my replacement questions the justification, overturning it would be more trouble than it's worth. I'm also sending a small reimbursement for your lost wages. It isn't much. There are more important things than pride and wealth. I hope you'll continue to use such good judgment in the future. I'm a Mandalorian, Chancellor. We may not follow your rules, but we've got our priorities straight. You may not know how to handle a blaster, but you're prepared to die for what you believe in. That's good enough for me. Live in honor, Chancellor, wherever you end up.